30 years. I love her to death. You're going to think she's a firecracker. Put it together for Phyllis Boren. Wow, this is a very good looking crowd. Well, not you. I'm only kidding. I'm only kidding. I think we've already established I'm not 25. But in cat years, I'm only 14. <laughs> but before I start my routine, I gotta tell you people something that just happened to us when we were parking our car. I overheard a woman tell her friend, oh, people have a smell. <laughs> well, sure we do. Mine is beer and marijuana. <laughs> is this a ganji crowd? Jew in marriage you want. <laughs> right. But um, let me tell you, uh, I, I, I completely lost my place. I'll talk to you instead. What's your name? McKenna. Is that like a machine? McKenna? Okay, let's try a couple names. What's yours? Crystal. Crystal, meet McKenna. She's not a machine. Okay. Well, let me tell you, uh, some women have so much trouble with the aging, they'll put anything on their skin if they think it'll make them look younger. You know this, right? My girlfriend uses Preparation H. <laughs> preparation? What if her date says, gee, hun, you look great, but what's that smell? <laughs> Wouldn't you feel like an asshole? <laughs> I'm on the cusp of see-through panties and depends. <laughs> what are you, babies? You don't know what depends are? Your diapers, crystal, fuck, I hope you never have to use them. But buy them. But let me tell you, it's not aging that bothers me so much. It's my, my, my abilities are breaking down. Like for instance, I signed up for Kundalini Yoga. Why? I thought it was Kundalingus Yoga. You should have seen their faces when I showed up in my crotchless pants. And, and, and even worse, last month, a good friend, well, a former good friend, invited me to a Lottie Da charity event. Well, I'm so fidgety. So he leans over and whispers, would you please sit on your hands and stay in your place? But I thought he said, will you please pull down your pants and sit on my face? <laughs> So I did. I'm codependent. Okay, I, I gotta tell you, I'm not too happy about the way my body is changing. For instance, for instance, my boobs are sagging. My cups runneth over. I used to be a 34B, now I'm a 34 long. I've seen guys at the beach with more uplift than me. And when I say when I say my boobs are going sad, I'm not talking Santa Monica. No, right about now they're crossing the equator. <laughs> not so bad in the winter because they keep my knees dry. Knees warm. Dry and warm. Tell me, McKenna, do you have that problem? <laughs> now, now, okay, some women can wear stretch bras. I had to get a winch. <laughs> and oh, oh, just to make my day complete, I read this morning that as a woman ages, her vagina drops. <laughs> well, I guess I'll have to date shorter guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, let me tell you, this is a savvy You're, That's okay, I'll wait. <laughs> savvy group. You guys know that size doesn't matter. I'm 
unless you want to have intercourse. <laughs> okay, I've been researching penises, and actually there's a, there's a plural, it's penine. Sounds like pasta, doesn't it? I've been researching penises for like half a century, okay? And I'm not, I'm still fascinated. I'm not saying they're pretty. <laughs> but they are entertaining. Girls, will you back me up? When guys walk around naked with all that bouncing and bobbing, <laughs> tell me, tell me it's not a puppet show. <laughs> to get a tattoo on my labia. Raise your hand if you don't know what the labia is. <laughs> I'm getting a tattoo on my labia and it's gonna say, best if eaten by 2021. <laughs>